Hi, welcome to You Can Book Me. In this video, I'll walk you through how to set up your Google Calendar so you can use Google Teams as your meeting conference location. While you're in your You Can Book Me dashboard, go ahead and connect your Google Calendar. I'll go ahead and start by integrating my calendar with my credentials, authorizing the You Can Book Me app to locate my availability. Next, you'll see here that I have my Google Calendar connected and Google Meets is already set as one of my available meeting locations. I'm also going to go ahead and connect my Gmail so I can use my own domain to send out booking related notifications. And so now you see here, we're all set. My calendar is connected. I can use Google Meets and I can use my own domain for booking related emails. Next, let's apply Google Meets to our booking page. So in the what section, you'll see event details and location. This is where you'll always add your meeting location, whether it's in person, Zoom. In this case, we're gonna keep Google as our preferred option. And for my team, I just wanna make sure that my Teams feature here is enabled. And I have, again, Lola and Kelly available for Google Meets conferencing. So if you click into any of your team members, you'll see this confirmation here that Google Meets is being used to generate video conferencing links. So once this is all set, every team member listed on this booking page will be able to use Google Meets for any time that a meeting is booked. Go ahead and save the changes and you're all set. Now that Google Meets is set up for your team, you can head over to your calendar event settings to customize the calendar event that goes automatically on the calendar once a meeting is booked. In this example, the default settings show your booking page title, duration, reference, and your Google Meeting link as well. You can notice here on the right, here is a preview example of what the calendar event will look like once a meeting is booked. Let's go ahead and get something booked so I can show you a real example. All right, this is the live booking page. I will go ahead and confirm the booking. Once that's gone through, you'll see here that a confirmation page shows that a booking has been made. And now we'll see the calendar event on my calendar. You'll see here on my calendar that an event has automatically been placed. And when I click into it, you will see all the details of the booking, which includes the booking title, duration, booking reference, and that Google Meets link so I can meet my booker. Uh, you'll also notice that uh, up at the top, if you are using a Google Calendar, the meeting link also appears in this location icon. And for reassurance, you'll also notice that your confirmation goes out to the booker anytime the meeting is booked, and they also get the event details as in the confirmation with the Google Meets link. Thanks for watching.